The Huntsville community is mourning the loss of a 17-year-old May Jemison high schooler. Deontay Moore died Saturday morning from injuries after he was shot Friday night. A basketball star in school, he dreamed of turning pro when his life was cut short just a week before his 18th birthday. Today, Moore's peers had their first day back at Jemison High School, and the administration provided counselors to assist students and staff members who might need someone to talk to. Way 31's Olivia Schuler spoke to mental health professionals about how to support an adolescent as they work through the feelings of grief. Olivia. An unexpected de death in a high school community can have a large effect on a teenager's mental health. Counselors that I spoke to in the area said you need to let your child express their feelings while grieving. Huntsville therapist Travis Davis said the best way to remember Deontay Moore is to have some kind of ritual. Deontay's basketball coach said this. And just take just something from Ruth and place it into their own lives. Having a ritual for the individual would be important for a lasting memory and a good memory um, for as such an untimely event. Davis works with adolescents in the community. He said you should not suppress your child's feeling following a sudden loss. Parents can look at um, the behavior of the children to see if there's any performance in uh, loss in school. Counselor Ida Wadsworth said during the grieving process, it's important for your child to find someone they can open up to. In their life, sometimes they often feel as if the world is not as safe as it was before. So just finding that safe space and, you know, being able to talk to their parents or teachers is often difficult. At the moment, they might be confused, uh, but there is help and to help you process the emotions that you are feeling. Both counselors that I spoke to said every child grieves differently and emotionally they will not grieve the same way that an adult would. Reporting live in Huntsville, Olivia Schuler, Way 31 News. Thanks, Olivia. 20-year-old Keandre McGuire is now charged with capital murder after police say he shot and killed Moore. He was taken into custody by Huntsville police following that shooting. Moore's death marks the seventh homicide in Huntsville this year.